clock's busted. What am I paying my PTA dues for? I am gonna file a complaint. Is that why you're here? You left me in charge of Jeremy when you went off to Whitmore. I've had this on my calendar for months. Really? So no other reason. Why, is there something else you wanna talk about? Oh, come on, don't pretend like you're not still tingly from this morning. Can we just focus on Jeremy, please? Right, okay, well, speaking of hypotheticals, if Jeremy was running around with another girl, would you want to know about it? What are you talking about? What girl? Bonnie's little witch trainee, Liv. I saw her and Jeremy sharing a top shelf bottle of inhibition killer at the grill this morning. Jeremy wouldn't do that to Bonnie. Again, need I remind you he once had an affair with a ghost. I mean, the only thing that was missing was a sappy love song and a pottery wheel. He learned his lesson. Jeremy's not a cheater. Okay, sorry to keep you waiting. Bad news first. Jeremy's missed 11 days of school. He started three fights, and he's been caught cheating in math class. Twice. Cheating? That is so not like him. Go on, please. I'm sorry, you are Elena's... Ex-boyfriend. Ex, right? Can we not talk about this right now? Actually, it's relevant. Most problems in school are rooted in problems at home. Jeremy's in desperate need of a stable living situation. People who care about giving him that more than their own needs. Sounds like he's in desperate need of a less judgy counselor. We do care. We really do. We'll... We'll do better. I hope so. For Jeremy's sake. 